Good morning everybody, I forgot to vlog this morning, I'm also looking absolute, like an absolute mess because my hair is wet. Um, but the sun is looking so cute in my room this morning, like I'm loving it. Um, it's Tuesday morning and today basically I've got school, how fun. And then I'm going to volunteer and then I'm coming home. Exciting, I'm currently just uploading Wednesday's video because um, it needs to be uploaded. I am now back from school and it's ten past six. So I had school today which was pretty basic, pretty average and then I had volunteering and then we came home and I went to Lidl and they had these wafers um, which literally I love so much. Um, I bought these in Vienna and I was like you can only get these in Vienna so I made the most of them while I had them and now they've started selling them in the speciality section in Lidl and I was so happy and they also were selling Arizona tea for legit 99p so I was like oh, yes please thank you and I've never tried it before but I also really wanted to buy that in Vienna and I didn't I don't know why but I've got some now and it's sitting in the fridge waiting for me and I'm so happy and I also got myself a cup of tea and I put one of these caramel waffles on top of it and honestly I can't wait to eat this I'm just gonna flip it around and oh my god I don't know how I'm gonna eat this but the uh, tea makes it like all the caramel inside melt and it's gonna be so good <laughs> okay I'm gonna try this now oh my god don't go in the tea It's pretty good. I really should have got a plate, but I'll just put it on my laptop. Hygiene 101. I don't know how much later it is, but I'm currently just like writing up like a timeline for everything that happens in the GDR because basically we've got a mock and I haven't really got like a good contextual knowledge of like when stuff happens, so I'm just like writing out the dates from the textbook, like you can't really see um, because of the angle, but I'm just putting them all onto a Word document and then um, these are like all the key dates and the really key ones are bold, but then I'm just going to go in with like dates in terms of just like statistics and stuff and put them in a different colour and I'm doing a different colour for like each theme, yeah you can tell that's pink, so yeah that's what I'm doing now, it's currently like 9 o'clock so I don't know, it's kind of late for me but it's chill. So everyone, I think this is me done for the day. Um, I've done that much and I've like added everything from the textbook and then just added stuff from my notes. So yeah, fun times. I'm going to end today's part of the vlog here because I'm going to bed. But I'll see you tomorrow for Wednesday's part of the vlog. Good morning everybody. This is Wednesday morning and... Um, I'm not showing my face because I just look a mess today but I'm going to do some quick study rocket revision before school because I need to write an essay in my free but I'm not really sure like what content I'm going to use so I'm just going to look at the notes on here that they have and see what they've got and see what I should probably do because I don't really know what I'm doing um, for psychology by the way I never actually said that um, yeah so this is um, study rocket which is basically you can't really see it here it is um it's basically a website where um yeah so it's got all your course written out for you and you can read through it and just like take notes from it and do some questions on it and i haven't got like all the info about it yet but um yeah i really like using it um also you can earn money on it as well which i think is pretty cool um currently have a total of zero pounds and zero pence but i haven't been on since easter because we started a new topic like last week. I'm gonna study a bit of this now um, so that I can work out what I'm gonna write for this essay. And I also really like this for reading ahead as well because I read ahead last term and it, I actually found it like super useful. Like when we were doing it in class, I sort of already knew what was happening.
this is me done yay i'm gonna email this to myself and then i can type up the essay at school so yeah i feel like i actually know what i'm gonna write now thank you study rocket hi everybody so it's now wednesday afternoon i got back from school about an hour ago um yeah today's been all right and i did like a little presentation and my history teacher still wants me to do an epq which is really annoying because as much as it probably would be useful for me and I might enjoy it, I feel like I just don't want to put the extra stress on myself. Because I do have ideas for what I would do for it, but like, I feel like the sources and it would take up my whole summer writing it up. Like, I just don't want to put the extra stress on myself. So, like, especially because like, obviously school wouldn't appreciate how much YouTube, like that takes up a lot of my time. So, um, although it's like voluntary and I choose to do it because I really like it, um, don't really have time to fit in an EPQ. So it is a bit irritating when I get told, oh, you should do one because I'm from the outside the ideal candidate because I'm only doing three A-levels and I'm predicted like A's. So yeah, I just thought I would mention that. Um, but I'm not going to do one because I, for what I said earlier, and I'm stubborn as well. I think I'm going to do a bit of psychology blurting for some of the topics that I've forgotten and I'm going to maybe type up some notes because I actually really enjoy using Study Rocket this morning. The approaches chapter I feel like is really difficult to get your head around the essays so Study Rocket although oh my um I'm doing another caramel wafer and it just fell in my tea so that's great. Um, the approaches chapter it was kind of hard to get your head around the essays because it's like it's very different to the other ones that we've done so far so Study Rocket was really useful because it like concises it so much so you know what the essentials are then you can beef it up with your own notes if you want to um so i really like that i might do a bit more of that and i actually found that my essay was so much easier to write than i expected after i've done study rocket so but yeah i'm gonna tidy up my desk my desk is in actual state um oh and my camera battery re is flashing i've got wires my purse hand cream just stuff everywhere so i'm gonna tidy this up i mean it's not actually that messy but I can't exactly work on it, can I? So it's seven o'clock and I got all my stuff out to do work, but then I turned my phone on and I clicked on a notification and suddenly three hours had passed. So um, yeah, that's been my night so far. But then at the same time, I feel like everybody does that every now and then, including me, strange surprise. I mean, who could have guessed? Um, but I'm gonna do this and yeah and I'm not gonna do study rocket tonight because this is more important right now. I also made this tiny little book for blurting out my psychology notes um basically I'm pretty sure I took this from a history lesson um in year 11 and put it in my drawer because something told me I'd need it and I decided to just do all my blurting in here and it's all like together because it's not like notes that I will refer to ever again, but I just like knowing that I've kept it. I don't know, but it's just quite nice to keep it in here. And I use the flashcards as prompts um, because they're pretty detailed. I mean, that one actually isn't, but these ones are quite detailed. Where's another one? Oh, they've all got sticky notes on them. It doesn't actually matter. Okay, so I've done these three so far. And the first one looks pretty good. Like there's not a lot of red on it that I had to add at the end. But then... Um, I mean, I've only filled half the page, but like, I know a lot less than I think I did. Like, there's great big chunks of information that I just forgot. Um, this one's not so bad either, but this is like this topic, and the other one were really easy topics. So, yeah, that's great. I've got a test. I don't even know when I've got the test. I think it could be tomorrow. I actually need to check that. Um, but I mean, I honestly like if I'm being honest I can bullshit research methods quite easily because you can just go for the generic points I can go for the generic points but it doesn't really give me good answers like I just end up repeating myself rather than having like an actually good answer so I don't know but this is like the easy section of research methods so it's great that I know it guys we're out of focus and it's going to stay that way but i've chucked on a face mask and i finished the revision i wanted to do like i didn't actually finish all of it but like i did enough and it's now quarter to nine so i'm going to head off to bed early because um i think i'll get up early and actually do something so yeah hey everybody so it's thursday and i'm actually just back from school this morning i like tried to do some mechanics questions i literally got all of them wrong 
and because of that I literally had no time to film so yeah also the sunlight yesterday woke me up this morning I mean woke me up at quarter to five like 4 45 in the morning like anyway I'm super excited now because I've just got a delivery from a brand called Chiquel it's like a clothing brand and I told them to chuck the parcel into the back garden because obviously I was at school so I'm gonna collect it now oh my god it's actually so hot I love it and here it is um i'm gonna keep you away from that in case there's an address i just love this little message yeah so that's what the brand's called i really really want to open it now but i'm gonna film like an unboxing first impressions of it so i can't open it until i film it is what i just meant to say but i feel like it'll be really bad quality because it's after school and i look like shit but it's also really sunny so i don't know i'm gonna check what the natural lighting at the weekend's gonna be like and based on that i'll decide whether i do it tonight or not because i really really want to open it i'm not going to film it tonight because i feel like it'll be really rushed if i do and there's points and stuff that i need to mention so i'm gonna hide it so that i don't feel sad um but this um i think this will maybe already be up um when no but the video will be up on the 16th of may i believe so if this isn't up before watch out for that if not um you can go watch it now um i'm just putting some socks in the wash <laughs> so it's a lot later now it's 20 past eight and i just did a load of psychology notes um yeah um these like these ones here were the ones i did the other morning but all this has been done tonight and i actually have to book our parents evening appointments so i'm going to do that now and i they've got like a new system where you like we have to now book it online, which is a pain because we've never had to do that before. So I'm having to work out to do that, which is fun. Um, I haven't done anything on my to-do list because the psychology notes that I just had done, I wasn't actually... I spontaneously decided to do them because I actually really enjoy using Study Rocket and I didn't fancy making history mind maps. So I did some Study Rocket because I actually enjoy it. Um, but I haven't actually done what I planned to do, so that's fun. Also, my mum brought me some chocolate because she is an actual babe. So I've just logged onto this website called Exam Solutions and I just thought I would mention this because I found, think this is a really useful resource if you're doing A-level maths. Um, or GCSE actually, this is the new spec that I'm doing, you've got the old spec and GCSE here as well. For those of you guys doing GCSEs, and basically it just it has a list of all your topics and there's videos and all of them so I don't know solving linear equations I wish we were still doing this I loved it um, and then there's a video on each topic and then you get like summary exercises what I really like about this is it's really well like um, structured I am not whatsoever sponsored or anything, I'm just telling you about this because I genuinely find it really useful. Like this is my go-to revision with resource for maths. Um, so I'm going to be doing some, um, what am I going to be doing? Some logarithms um, because I don't really understand the questions. If you want to find something on a page, I find this the most useful thing ever. I don't know if it works on... Um, macbooks or anything but it works on pc okay i think it's lit up a bit more if you click Control f this thing comes up in the corner and you can search for something on the page so say i want to find the log videos i'll just put in logs up there and it will find it on the page so i don't know if people know this or not because i don't think people do know this but it's literally so useful so i don't have to scroll through like everything i just go to where it finds it for me um it comes up on the side and here is everything that i'm gonna need and for those of you who like to know this is the maths work i did just like a couple of questions and i went over the basics um yeah very exciting um i'm gonna file this away so it's friday morning and i've got myself some watermelon yum yum and a cup of peppermint tea and I'm actually just going to sit and do some more study rocket revision. Um, yeah, very exciting. Um, I'm actually going to eat a proper breakfast later like that. I'm not just eating this, that would be quite bad. But Let's do some revision. Also, how cute does my room look in the morning? 
So guys, I'm now back from school and I'm actually eating myself. I mean, myself. I'm eating a salad. And this is actually watermelon. And oh my god, this looks so good. I've got feta cheese. I've got lamb at the bottom. I've got spinach, olives, um, red onion. I am literally living for this salad. I oh, can't. Yum. And now I have some pita bread. Let's eat this. Yum, yum, yum. Um, why do I put this? Just here. Yum. And I'm probably going to put on some YouTube while I do this. Um, yeah, pretty happy right now. Hi, everybody. So it's actually the next day, but I just wanted to say that I never ended the vlog because I just kind of just watched a load of YouTube videos. I never do work on Fridays and I just chilled at the end of the week and I just forgot to end the vlog. So yeah, I hope you don't mind and I'll see you another time for another vlog.